Hi, Diane here. I have imported this little Easter scene for this tutorial from freepix.com. I will put the information on how to get the image at the end of the tutorial. It was an EPS file, so I had to bring it into Illustrator and separate all the pieces and save them as JPEGs so that I could import them into Cartoon Animator as props. Let's select one of our props, the tall white daisy. Now we're going to open our prop motions. It's going to be under animation. Open our prop motions and this is in our content manager and we're going to go to emphasis right here. 3G motions, spongy moves. Now we have a whole selection of types of spongy moves and for this one we're going to go to transition and I really like this little wind breeze. So we're going to click on it, make sure that we're at the beginning. It's not going to be a big movie, so I'm going to bring the end of the video down to here. Now we're going to click on the wind breeze and apply it to the large flower. Now that's just cool. It just makes a real soft breeze for the flower. So now we're going to go back to the beginning and let's do something with the little flower. We don't want a lot of motion for it, so let's go up here to above the prop is FD Motions. And they have this little one called Breathe. Let's just select it. And there we go. Now you have a soft breeze at the top and the little flower has just a little breeze in it. Now let's go back to the beginning and let's select the red egg. Now we're going to go to the 3G Elastic Motions and we're going to select Move this time. And under Move we want Slack Race Stumble. Now you can actually play with every one of these. They, they're, they're just cute movements and I've played with all of them so you need to play with all of them to find the move that you want. If you don't like what you've selected and applied, all you have to do is go right up here and just hit this back arrow and it'll just immediately take it off. So you can actually go through all of them and try it. If you don't like it, click out. Try it. If you don't like it, click out. So we're going to click on slack race stumble and we're going to apply it to the red egg. Whoa! And it made the egg hop and jump off the screen. That's perfect. So go back to the beginning and now we're going to select the green egg and under G3 exit we're going to pick the random path out three. There it is. And when you're playing with this, the fun part is just just run down and play with all of them. It doesn't take that long. Now we're going to apply it to the green egg. Make sure you're at the beginning and apply it. And here we go. Whoa, it looks like I just popped a balloon. Oh, that was cute. So now go back to the beginning and we're our final one. We're going to click our blue egg and in the same directory, we're just going to go up to the top and there's one called high bar gymnast jump out. Wow, that is a mouthful. Okay, we're going to select it and apply it. Make sure we're at the beginning. Whoa, and it just jumped and rolled off the screen. That is absolutely perfect. And now we're ready to actually render our video. So we're going to go to render the video. I prefer MP4. For me, it just seems like it's a lot better uh, all the way around. I'm going to lock my ratio. I'm going to export it. Now, as soon as it exports it, it's going to come back in and say, would you like to watch it? And we're going to say yes. And here's our little video. <laughs> Isn't that cute? Well, I hope you had fun with the prop motions playing around. Now you can get out there and create your own fun moving projects. Have a great day. Diana.